Hi, this is Pat Moorhead checking out the latest Palm Pre smartphone. I wanted to take you through a couple cool features that uh, I thought really set it apart. Uh, first of all, the concept of smartphone multitasking. It's uh, capable in models like the Blackberry, but the Palm Pre really makes it a lot easier. As you can see, I'm scrolling through multiple uh, active programs here. Uh, as you can see, I have the Palm, uh, Palm website. And uh, to make it go away, you just do a shift of the thumb. I've got my uh, dialer pad here. Make a phone call. And I even uh, have a video running as well. That uh, just the fact that uh... so hopefully you can see uh, how good that looks. Uh, and obviously right here I have uh, Google Maps. So uh, not only could you multitask between different applications in a relatively easy way, you can also with just a one uh, thumb flick uh, get into some of the main areas here as you can see down here. And if uh, any of you are, uh, are uh, users of Trios, it'll, it'll look pretty familiar uh, to you. So uh, let's take a look. Uh, we already looked at videos. Let's take a look at the uh, the pictures. There we go. Hit some of the standard uh, wallpapers, and as you can see, it's uh, very snappy. Uh, the interface uh, to me is uh, really nice. Here we have music. Uh, I imported it. Uh, you can import the music uh, two ways. You can do it through iTunes or you can just dump uh, some of your music uh, into the, the root folder uh, when you connect it to your PC. Uh, some of my art came through. Uh, some of it didn't. And uh, one of the key features that, that I like is to be able to go through and just go from song to song. Very nice. So uh, you might not like my taste in music, but uh, hopefully you uh, like some of the uh, features and functionality. And again, shutting down an application is uh, as easy as a flick of the wrist. Uh, some of the things that uh, I downloaded here were LinkedIn. That was a nice, uh, nice version of this uh, native application. AP News, AccuWeather, Pandora for uh, music where for geo-based location and, and obviously uh, New York Times. And you move from uh, window to window and you can see this little uh, dot down here saying exactly uh, where you are. Now, uh, you can input uh, text through this handy dandy keyboard in here. While not as comfortable uh, as the Blackberry Bold keyboard, uh, I, I like it because I can be more accurate on a keyboard than I can with a screen. The other thing I appreciate is the, the at, the specific at and dots if you're putting in uh, uh, in a website. So the other, other interesting feature is how you uh, go backwards. And that may sound like uh, something trivial, but uh, is pretty important when, uh, when you're doing uh, different applications. Uh, on the BlackBerry, you have a, a back uh, button, and uh, let's say uh, you're looking at your music here, and let's load this up again. And you want to hit uh, albums, and let's say you made a mistake, you actually go with a flick of the wrist to go backwards. And you saw the uh, saw the light light up; uh, it went backwards. So. Some very cool features. The other thing I like too, and I've had a lot of smartphones, is this is very uh, compact. You can easily fit uh, in the front of a shirt uh, pocket or um, you know, in your uh, pants pocket or in your uh, purse or really uh, anywhere. It's one of the smaller ones out there on the market. So with that, uh, hopefully this is informative um, and uh, you should try one out. They're, uh, they're a lot of fun.